All right, you guys, do you want to go to Walmart with me? I did remember a list. I did not forget it. It is actually feels absolutely amazing. Sorry, my hand's right there. In Kansas today. Like, it feels awesome right now. It's still, like, just a little sticky. Hey, can I tell you guys? Sorry, I'm a squirrel. Um, what? Sorry. At least you're not staring at my armpit. It's okay, I shaved it. Um, you know, as you get older, the little things you get excited by. I, t I bought these leggings at Sabres or workout pants, whatever. And it fits my wallet. It fits my little wallet. Okay. And I'm like, I don't have to carry a purse or anything. I put that there. And then I put my cell phone right there. Okay. And then look at, I made that. Don't be a salty pepper. I thought, it, ooh, is it sprinkling? I don't know. Um, so I'm going to Walmart. I've been trying to go to Walmart like by myself without the the family. Um, because it's just way easier than dragging all three kids and stuff. And then after that, we'll all go as a family because I know my husband. He needs to get out of the house. Like, that guy would go stir crazy if he stayed in the house all day. Ooh, gonna talk like this. But, let's see if I can prop you guys up. Like I said, these are just gonna be what they're gonna be. Okay? Um, yeah, John would go stir crazy if we stayed home all day. So, uh, I'll come back and then at least, like, bulk of the food will be at home and then we're gonna go to sam's club because there's certain things that we like to get at sam's club like um i feel like their produce is really good way better than walmart so i like to get our strawberries there the bread that everly loves comes in a two pack there and they're both eating sandwiches now since they're back at school so um that's a better value what else do we get from there they have little individual salads that come in a two pack and it's way cheaper that way than buying it at Walmart in their little separate ones because their little salads are like three seventy five dollars or something. So I wanted to get that. I wanted to get butcher paper, not only for sublimation and their butcher paper is like a humongous roll for 25 bucks, but, um, we, can use it to make football banners, you know, for the little football players to run through. Why does it feel like my heater's on? So I wanted to get that. So there's just like things, and then they have these amazing shorts there. I grabbed one pair the last time because I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna like them. And they're amazing. They feel so good on, and they don't ride up my butt. They're just like jogger kind of short looking things, like not, you know not jean shorts so I'm gonna go do that of course when I get to Walmart I have to go through the clearance section because last time I went there I think I no maybe I didn't tell you but last time I went there in the clearance section you all know Walmart is like a hit or miss kind of clearance because I feel like majority of the time their clearance stuff is only marked down like 50 cents. And I'm like, that is not clearance at all. Um, and even if it's marked down just a dollar, I'm like, that's still not a markdown. Like a, like a clearance to me needs to be 50% off or more of the original price. Um, but they had these floral um, bundles one was like these white florals. I don't know what they're called. Um, they were a dollar. Then they had this big bouquet of like, sorry, I talk with my hands. Of this, uh, it was like greenery with, it looked like foxtails were in it. And uh, what were those flocking balls? And I don't know, but this, this bundle was like a huge bouquet and they were only a dollar. So, although I don't always find stuff, sometimes there are those random things that are super 
inexpensive. So you just always got to look just like when you go to Dollar Tree, you got to look down every dang aisle to see what's new. So hopefully I can remember and turn on my camera when I'm walking through because I always like to walk through like <laughs> the clothing to see what's in now. Basically Clueless is back. I don't know if anybody knew that, but that's basically what the kids are wearing. If you've ever seen the movie Clueless, if you've ever read Jane Austen's book, well, <laughs> Jane Austen's book, Jane Austen's book, that is where Clueless derives from, but obviously the fashion was completely different. So scratch that. Um, so we're going to drive down there. Walmart from my house is about 20 minutes or so. Any store is except Price Chopper, but I like Walmart because one-stop shop you know I could get diapers I could get all the stuff I need so then we need to go look at a house at noon so this house John isn't thrilled about at all it's a very weird layout I I feel like at this point I want to see everything like if I have any kind of doubts about it I'm like it doesn't hurt to look like it doesn't we're not doing anything today like what if we went and it was like, oh my gosh, yeah, I can work with this or what have you. I think for this house, the winning factor is that it has a humongous, humongous basement where I can work. And it even has an additional room in the basement that can be a fifth bedroom. It doesn't have a closet, so it can't be deemed that but we can make it into like a guest bedroom, you know? So, uh, we look at that at 12 and then of course I'll try and take you along. I need to ask my realtor. She's out of town. So it's somebody else. So I need to ask if they feel comfortable with me filming and yeah, so I'm going to get driving and then, well, I am driving. I'm going to drive and then I will, uh, turn back on the camera if I find anything awesome ads Walmart sorry my drink was in the way the entire time if anybody drinks energy drinks or just like canned drinks in general even if it's a beer or something these brewmate cans are absolutely amazing I'm somebody that like sips my people are going to be yelling at me because I keep taking my hand off the wheel but that's real life okay um I sip my energy drinks. I don't like chug them. And this keeps it cold throughout the day. And I love it. Especially too, like if you're, if you leave something in your car, like if you're a soda person or whatever, that comes with like a little cooler thing on the bottom that you could put in there. Okay, anyways, I'll let you go. Okay, this is what I was talking about, Clueless. Like, doesn't this remind you of something or like this? that Dion would have worn, right? Like what? Are people allowed to wear this to school, like teenagers? Are they? And then look, oh my gosh. Okay. Like, I feel like Cher had her own like super, like this. Oh my gosh, no way. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is for real. And I'm not saying any of this is ugly at all. I'm just saying that like, I can't believe the stuff that comes back. These are super cute. Like if I actually had a life and went out, I would totally, oh, look at how cute. I like those. But I would totally wear those with some wedges, but we don't ever do anything or go anywhere. And then look at those pants over there. Oh my gosh, so crazy. Oh, if you guys sublimate, actually, I might get one of these to make a another cheer shirt. These are, if you sublimate, they're six bucks. And I believe they're like almost all polyester. 100% recycled polyester. But I want to make a cheer shirt. Oh, that's large. They only have larges, so I'll get it. It's fine. Okay, I was saying, look at those 
pants right there. Oh my gosh, and that. Ooh. How funny. Oh, what are these? Oh, high rise skinny. High rise mom. I love the no boundaries. Just go up a size if you're in woman sizes. Like, I would probably wear the 11 instead of a 9. Oh, I don't know. I'm pretty tall. So some of those look like high waters on me, but I will probably look at those. Halloween's already here. Look at that. I'll just take it. I'm not trying to do a browse with me video here, but that would probably scare the crap out of my kids or they would just love it. That's not bad for 288. These are the times I need to tell myself I don't need anything. I bought those two warmers last year and I don't even think I got them out because again, pregnant and I didn't want to do anything last year. Oh my gosh, that's $5. It's not even that big. Look at these. We can make these with the Dollar Tree. This is like completely plastic. Nope, those aren't that great. All right, you guys, I don't really see anything that exciting. 644, we can make that cheaper with real wood. Yeah. Uh, Nothing that like blows my mind, especially for the price. Here's like, oh, these are so cute. The pastels. Look at how cute all of this would be. Oh my gosh, that's expensive. You guys, I'm either like super frugal or just, I don't know, but that to me for $8 is expensive. Like how much is that one? $4, 4 dollars 444 yeah. Sorry, you guys. Mama too cheap. And then pastels right there. I do think their picks are super affordable here. Alright. Let's go to the clearance. That's what I could afford. <laughs> clearance has a lot of stuff. But again, look at that. Well, $694, $548 to me. That's still too much. Oh, these are nice towels. But we always use our towels to wipe up pink drool, so those are like 50% off. That's not bad. Again, I move a lot in my lives. I'm just going fast, you guys. I'm not trying to make this. Oh, that's cute. Oh my gosh, that's still so much. $3.48 off, so not 50. It's 8.21. I don't think there's anything, let's see. Like seriously, they have a lot. And even on their shelves, it's like roll back, roll back, roll back. This is the time to pick up Christmas gifts. I feel like Everly has kind of outgrown all of this stuff or else I probably would have bought it. No. So they have it really well organized in here. Oh wow. That's a good deal. They haven't been playing chalk outside though. See, this is stuff that I would buy just to put away in case like a birthday party comes up or something, you know, for five. Ooh, I'm gonna put it in the cart and then I could always take it back out. But for $5, it's, ooh. All of their bubbles, swim diapers. Let's see. I think there's one more aisle. Yup. Candles. I do Scentsy warmers, so candles don't usually buy. Uh, 
these are nice and we actually use them all the time but of course they're super girly eh. she won't mind and i'm talking about everett some things he's like i don't want that that looks girly i'll just get one tons of school supplies on clearance all right, nothing. I think there's another row too. These are good for sublimation too. These frosty looking ones, but still too much. All right. Okay, I know there's another one. Is there? Yeah, because I was like, this is where I found the florals last time. I like how I'm whispering, like I don't want anybody else to know about it. They have tons of cricket. Uh, what else? This stuff. Okay, their florals are wiped out. I always gotta look down there. They got oh, still too much. Those are cute. They're not on the clearance. Somebody put them there. Okay, that was the clearance section. Oh, there's still more over here. Jeez. Uh, dog stuff. Um, all right. So, it's like resin stuff. It's 97 cents off. Oh my goodness. And lots of baby stuff. I thought about getting one of these, but I haven't been carrying her because my back is bad. Anyways, what are these? Nope, we're not gonna be that size for a while. All right, so that was the clearance, you guys. You guys, my Walmart is totally stepping it up. Look at this. Oracle 651, I have never seen that here before. I don't know what Oro tape is. I guess removable, 631. And Sizer Easy Weed is now here. That's crazy, oh. It's cheaper if I just order it online. And then I think they're flaw. flaw. I need to get more lamb's ear, boxwood. Ooh, those are nice. That lavender back there. The baby's breath. Let me see. I know. Oh, that's cute. Again, I move fast, so close your eyes. Let me see what they got for the fall. Mm, looks like everything is really glittery. Oh, you guys, look. These were the $1 ones. I'm gonna scan it. These were the $1 ones I was talking about. And it looks like there might be another one hidden right there. See you guys, you gotta look around because you never know. Let's see what the pen is. No, this is like, I don't know what this is. Oh no, it is. It is, you guys. Do I look at Sorry you guys for the abrupt ending to that Walmart visit, but we ended up going to Sam's Club. Well, we ended up driving by that house. Um, the one I said that we were gonna go look at. I don't know where to look, there, there there and um we weren't a fan of the neighborhood and the house actually backed up sorry there i go with the finger again hi you want to say hi we want to take you out yeah. give me that what give me that you're putting it in a bowl babe there are directions um oh um they the house backed up to a major street and it's that smiling now, mama. You know there's food coming, huh? Yeah. Um backed up to a major street. The neighborhood just wasn't that great. And we noticed like in the backyard in the pictures, you can tell that like the backyard kind of like it looked like it had like a patio and then it like went down but when we actually went over there it went down like 
So um, we just drove by. Luckily, our um, agent was not there because that would have been horrible to waste her time. But we ended up just driving by and then we went to Sam's Club. Say hi, Nick. Can you say hi? Hi, Nicky. Can you say hi? No. You're just staring at yourself. Um, so yeah, now we're home. We got home from Sam's Club and we got their sushi. For those of you that don't have sketchy sushi in your area. Well, it doesn't matter because some places are sketchy, but Sam's Club, they're making it right there, like at the bar. It is fresh and it is so good. So we always buy like the variety platter and then um, we just like eat it throughout the day for lunch and dinner. Who's that? I don't even think she's looking at herself. All right, you guys, so we are going, I'm gonna change her, feed her, and then we are going to eat our sushi and enjoy the rest of our Sunday. So I hope you guys are having a great weekend, bye.